Hello everyone, welcome to Elif's Kitchen. Today I will be sharing my special Turkish delight recipe with pomegranate and hazelnuts. If you liked my video, please click the like button and subscribe to my channel and click on the bell button to be notified about my new recipes. Let's start. Firstly, we are preparing the sherbet. I put four glasses of sugar to the pot. Then I add one and a half glasses of water. I also add a slice of lemon. I frequently stir until the sherbet boils. See, it started boiling. I leave it to boiling on low heat for 15 minutes. Meanwhile, I will be squeezing the juice of my pomegranates. I wash them and now I divide them in half. This way it is really easy. There is no need to remove the seeds. As you see, I easily squeeze the juice. I apply pressure with a little spoon to have some more juice from the pulp. Then I strain my juice as you see. Meanwhile, my sherbet has been boiling for 15 minutes on low heat. I take out the lemon slice and put the sherbet aside. Now I have two glasses of pomegranate juice. I pour it on a pot and add a glass of starch. Then I add 10 grams of cream of tartar. It is approximately one dessert spoon. I add a glass of water and start mixing with a beater. Then when the ingredients melt, I put it on the stove. It is really important to constantly stir until it boils. As it starts boiling, I make the heat lower and add my sherbet slowly. I add gradually and continuously stir meanwhile. By the way, we add cream of tartar for the stiffness of real Turkish delight. I hope you can easily find it in the grocery stores. I will bake the delight on medium low heat for 45 minutes. It's really important to continue to stir all the time, otherwise it will stick to the pan. You can see that it will gradually become stiffer. Now 30 minutes have passed and as you see it become really rigid. I stir faster and more frequently. Yes, finally 45 minutes have passed. It's really important to continue to stir all the time. As you see, none of it stuck to the pan. I add 60 grams of hazelnuts. I turn the stove off now. To the bottom of a Pyrex, I spread plenty of plain coconuts. I use approximately 50 grams of coconuts. I pour my delight now. I straighten out the surface as much as I can. See, it's really easy to make. I add plain coconuts at the top also. I adjust the top with my hand. Now I will wait until it cools down to room temperature for 30 up to 60 minutes. When it completely cools down, I will cover up with a plastic wrap. It will be in the fridge overnight. Yes, a night has passed. Now I took my light outside the fridge. As there isn't coconut on the sides, it may stick a little. We can easily solve this with a knife. I turn it upside down and it really easily came out as you see. You can slice it at any size you want. It's really tasteful as real Turkish delight. I really suggest you to try this recipe. Pomegranate and hazelnut taste very good together. I first sliced a long stripe, now I slice into small cubes. It also looks very nice. You can use powdered sugar instead of coconut if you wish. You can pour a little amount of oil to the Pyrex to be able to take out easier if you are going to use powdered sugar. As you see, I cover all sides with coconuts. 
My Turkish delights are ready to serve. It looks beautiful as you see. It has a perfect taste and stiffness. I strongly recommend you to try this recipe. I hope you try and like it. If you liked my video, please click the like button and subscribe to my channel and click the bell button to be notified about my further recipes. Thank you for watching.